Welcome to the Digital Moneta channel. Today we're going to take a look at the Exodus all-in-one wallet that you download to your computer. The first thing you do is you want to go to exodus.io and we've included a link down below to ensure you get to the right uh, location. Once you arrive on their homepage, you can actually watch their demos or their launch videos if you want to learn a little more about them. They have some sample screenshots you can take a look at. They've got a list of all the assets that they actually support and it's a pretty good variety of assets. They include most of your top assets. There's a few we'd like to see them add like Horizon would be a good one for them to add. For the most part they have the main coins like Bitcoin, Dash, uh, they obviously have your Ethereum Classic and Ether, Litecoin. So they have the main coins that most people are going to be starting out with anyway. So let's go ahead and get to it. It's pretty simple right here at the top of the page is a big download button. You simply click on that. Choose what operating system you're running. This uh, computer is actually a Windows machine. We've loaded it on Linux machines and it works perfect on those as well. Uh, but we're going to go ahead and choose Windows and we'll save the file. And while you're waiting for your download to go, you could always take a look at the latest release and what updates they've included in that release. Uh, it will show you that they've added Tron to the exchange. Uh, you know, the, the wallet. Uh, has added Tron as well, USDT, so your Tether. So you can look through the different updates that they've done while you're waiting for the download to finish. Once your download is finished, you go to your download file and just simply double click on the Exodus Windows file and it will begin installing and it doesn't take long and then it is installed and you receive the message Exodus has been installed and you can run it from the shortcut on your desktop so when we jump over to our desktop we can see that Exodus is indeed a shortcut on our desktop and we just double click on that and it will go ahead and open the Exodus wallet and what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and restore a wallet that we had on another computer. And so we're going to choose this option, get started by sending assets to your wallet or restore from backup. We're going to restore from a backup. So we go ahead and click on restore from backup and we're going to use the 12 word recovery phase. And then what will happen is Exodus will restart and then ask for those 12 the 12 word phrase and so we'll go ahead and click OK and then Exodus will restart and then we would put in our 12 word phrase and once you start typing your phrase in you'll want to put one space in between each word once you have the 12 word passphrase put in You'll go ahead and hit the arrow button and hopefully it will restore your wallet and you'll be able to see your assets inside the Exodus wallet. And restore complete. Your Exodus wallet is restored. And once you have restored your wallet, you can now send or receive any of your assets that you actually have in the wallet so you would simply click on send you could put the Bitcoin address in there or you could put the QR code and scan the QR code and then you just put the amount you could put either Bitcoin as the amount and it will show you the US dollar amount or you can put the dollar amount and it will show you the Bitcoin amount and then it would show you how much you're actually gonna send down here it will show you the fee and then how much you have remaining and then with receive basically you could copy the address or scan the QR code you could print the address if you want to have that on file or you can email yourself the address as well 
So if, once your assets are on board, you have the ability to send them or receive more assets. Also a great feature built into the Exodus wallet is the exchange, which will allow you to exchange your Bitcoin for Ether or a variety of other tokens. As you can see here, I could exchange it for Binance tokens. I could exchange it for Dash. I've got a variety of tokens here that I would actually be able to exchange my Bitcoin into OMG, what have you. So that's another very powerful uh, feature built into the Exodus wallet. If you go up to portfolio, you can see your current portfolio. It will also show you how much it's gone up or down in 24 hours. It'll show you your highest balance that you've had on the wallet. We try not to keep too much in the Exodus wallet. Uh, we prefer keeping it offline like in a Trezor. That would be our preferred storage for the majority of our Bitcoin. So most of these numbers are just passing through. They're either going to exchanges or they're coming from miners or off exchanges to be sent to a wallet. And then a few more of the features we can see. It's got a real nice format. If you're accustomed to trading, it will kind of show you the trend line, uh, the market cap, volume, 24 hour change, your current balances, the US dollar value, and what percent of your portfolio that actually takes up. And we find the Exodus wallet to be extremely user friendly. Also, we've had a little bit of experience with their tech support. One of our clients accidentally sent Bitcoin to a Bitcoin cash wallet. And through tech support, they were actually able to help us get that straightened out and sent back to the correct wallet all through email. And it was truly a painless operation that they were able to assist us with. I think that's pretty much going to wrap this video up. We just wanted to do a quick video on the Exodus wallet. So if you like the video, please spike that like button. Also, please be sure to subscribe if you haven't already. And we'll see you in the next video.